feel like I need a glow stick with this song here. Susie Wallace, <laughs> Charlene Stahl expert, latest cover of Charlene Magazine. You know, she's always got the fun ideas of how you should be styling things up. Uh, this is an interesting day today because we're talking about Vancouver Fashion Week on a local scale here. Yeah, happening right now. Uh, they opened on Monday um, and they're going right through. So what we're seeing today is um, a smattering of what we can expect at Fashion Week. A ton of local talent mm -hmm. um, and some creative talent coming out of our schools too, as well as the more commercial side, which we'll get to later. Okay. But these lovely ladies are, the, their, their looks are the products of students at LaSalle College Vancouver in Yale Town. Of course, the famed LaSalle College Montreal has an outpost here. They opened in 2014. Um, and, and just really, really cool work. So this is what's happening behind the doors at schools in Vancouver. And how cool is this that they get to show at Fashion Week and work alongside artistic director Tracy Pincott. These girls are Liz Bell models. Chris Funk is doing the hair. You know, really talented Vancouverites coming on deck and helping out these schools at their very first show. So, um, our beautiful lady in black, uh, this is Leah. She is wearing Yi Cheng Chen. Um, the students were told to work with a 1920s influence with a bit of a modern twist. So sort of that lavish irreverence of the 20s um, that they were so famed for. Satin and mesh detail, got the fringe, the sparkles, the feathers. It's absolutely stunning to see this dress in person. Um, and next, over to the left, we've got Emily wearing uh, designer Adam Lynn, a beautiful piece. Again, we see a bit of that 20s influence, a little Mondrian, that sort of nod to 70s YSL. Um, sort of modern street chic, though, meets the 20s silhouette. But the point here is, this is great work. And this is what our students in Vancouver are cranking out through. Uh, thanks to Vancouver Fashion Week giving them a platform, right? Everything at Fashion Week is happening at the QE Plaza downtown. So they're really centralized this year, which is great. Thank you both girls very much. Nice job, ladies. So what happens? <laughs> uh, we've got our next two models coming out. If uh, fashions are seen on this platform, what happens for local designers trying to get noticed? What is really the next step? Well, you know what? It is a, it is a process for sure. And um, so much of it is about getting social media exposure and getting, you know, followers and getting people, you know, paying attention, following at Van Fashion Week and seeing what they're doing and, and really sort of following the steps um, to see what designers have done to bring it to market. This is a great example, these two women, of the commercial side of fashion. Both of these girls are wearing products available through Brunette Showroom. Um, Brunette Showroom's got a show this Friday night styled by uh, Tobruk Ave's Kiara Schwartz, um, Ryan Pugsley from About a Boy, Miriam Alden, who's from Brunette Showroom as well. So this is like the insider influencers, the commercial side of ha fashion in Vancouver. These are looks that you can buy for fall 2015 in town. Um, their show, like I said, is Friday night, but that is really what's happening on the other side of fashion, right? This is stuff you can purchase. Um, so first up, we've got this beautiful um, uh, velvet pantsuit, just super, super cool, um, beautiful. I should say also that the girls are going to have a pop-up shop while they're shooting. This is by Beautiful Stories from Iceland. Um, and then Donnie on my right is wearing an, an absolutely stunning outfit. I absolutely love this. So show us the fries before, guys. Okay? Your fiancé needs one of these. Oh, what? Prior Are you priorities, kidding me? <laughs> so that is uh, by Brunette is the new black. The girls will be selling these sweatshirts at um, their show this Friday night, $75. They've got a cool little pop-up shop there. But again, it's like bringing together really talented influencers in Vancouver to put these shows on. People always say there's not a lot of arts and culture happening in Vancouver. Not true. You just have to pull the curtain back and have a look. Call a girlfriend, go down at Van Fashion Week and see what's happening because it's a real link to you know what's hot in Vancouver right now. This is one of the fastest growing fashion weeks in the world. I love to see the tent outside on QE Plaza and you know what we'll call the other ladies back in and uh, get a look at yeah, uh, all four over. of Yay. these outfits. Uh, so pretty. We've got a great giveaway here. Two shows tonight mm -hmm. in LaSalle 6 p.m. You can go check it out or uh, Friday night at 5 p.m. We're giving away two sets of tickets. So subject line Van Fashion Week contests at btvancouver.ca if you'd like to win. And I know we see uh, four great looks for the ladies. We're covering off the guys at Fashion Week too. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> the guys missed my call for this morning. I didn't realize it was you. <laughs> I'll bring some guy fashion in a couple of weeks when I'm back. I promise. Awesome. Ladies, did a great job.